For those of you who don't want to use the mic input on your Harmony processor, but would prefer to use your mixer, um, there's a way to use a Harmony processor in the uh, auxiliary send and return connections of your mixer. So I'll show you how to do that now. And I'll show you how to do it with a VoiceWorks Plus that I have right here. First thing you're going to want to do, of course, is to plug your mic in, as you always do, into your mixer. I'm going to plug that into channel 4 here. Um, the next thing we'll plug in is a connection from the auxiliary send, which in this mixer, auxiliary send 1, which we're going to use, comes out this connection there, auxiliary send 1. And then we're going to bring a couple of connectors back from the Harmony processor to a ch stereo channel in this mixer. Right there, like that. Here's the return from VoiceWorks Plus, and here's our microphone. So these are our two levels controlling the mix. Now, on VoiceWorks Plus, I've got, here's the uh, send from the mixer going into the line input of VoiceWorks Plus, and I have the stereo outputs of VoiceWorks Plus coming to the channel here. So we'll switch over to this microphone and have a listen. One, two, three, there you are. Okay, so now we're talking into this microphone, and this microphone is going to be sent to the VoiceWorks Plus. Currently, it's not going to the VoiceWorks Plus. There's no meters jumping because I haven't turned this on yet. Actually, also, make sure that you've got the mic switch turned off when you're using the line input on the back of one. Here we go. So there we go. I turned up the auxiliary send one on the mixer and you can see that we've got meter deflection here it's a little too hot so I'm gonna go into the setup menu and the first menu in the setup menu is the line input sensitivity so I'm gonna turn that down just a little bit check 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 one two there we go so now we've got a reasonable sort of meter deflection there without incurring any distortion alright so we've got level coming to the VoiceWorks Plus. Now, do we have level coming back? Let's turn up the channel and have a listen. One, two, three. So we have harmonies going there. They weren't very in tune because I don't have a pitch reference nearby. But anyway, that means that signal's getting to the VoiceWorks Plus and coming back. One further thing we want to check is you want to make sure that the signal coming back from the VoiceWorks Plus doesn't have any of your dry mic coming into it. So we'll go into the setup menu again, press setup, and we'll go to setup menu number uh, 4, I4. And that has a parameter called dry voice in. You want to turn that off so that there's no dry coming through VoiceWorks Plus and coming back to your mixer. You don't want two, two dry paths. Okay, so out of that setup menu. So here we go. La. That's great. Just to confirm that what's coming through from the uh, rather what's coming back from the VoiceWorks Plus is completely wet. I'll turn off my mic here and we'll listen to just the VoiceWorks Plus. La. Yep, no dry mic at all. So that's about all we need to talk about for using an auxiliary send to drive a Harmony processor with your mixer.